Hello everyone, flashy username, back again with some more Super Auto Pets. And uh, I might have to admit that I have a small problem playing this game. Uh, after I stopped recording yesterday, I think I played about four hours <laughs> non-stop of this game. And it's... it's crazy. Like, it's only, only mildly problematic, I would say. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna buy some fish. I like buying fish because fish have a nice uh, level up ability. Uh, in the first few rounds, I like to buy things with nice sell abilities. Um, and we're gonna buy something here just because we want to fill a, fill out our fill out our team. We don't want to die to just someone who has a uh, three three large things. We are going to be the bumbling bones. Go ahead. So yeah, during the early waves, I've started to like really buying things with nice sell abilities. Um, we're gonna be able to probably lose to these ants. I don't know. Yep, it's a draw. The first few rounds, you usually end up in a draw. If you can get squeak away with an early win, that's pretty good, because I mean, it's one less win you have to do in the late game. Um, horse is actually really good if you're trying to do a creature synergy. And we're doing the base deck, so the creature synergy is something that is really good here. We will roll again, though. Duck. Duck's got a nice sellability. Um... Uh, we can roll again. Another duck. Uh, now we cannot roll again, but we can. Because we can freeze something else. I believe that next round is going to be the round where we get tier 2 pets. Uh, we don't actually want third duck. Even though it levels up the duck, we're probably going to sell them next turn. Uh, okay, we'll just go ahead and end. We're probably going to have an entirely different team next turn. We're going to just sell a lot of them. And probably pick out one of the stronger, stronger guys. Uh, let's see what happens. If this mosquito hits our first guy, it's gonna be bad, but that's not that bad. This beaver is gonna actually wreck our day. Yep, that beat the last beaver wrecked our day, but that's all right. The first losing in the beginning is also not that bad, because you know it's only one life at the beginning. Now it's two life. Uh, we got an elephant. Elephant's great for damage, and so is the rat. Actually, I like both those guys. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and sell my ducks. Sell two ducks. Put these guys back here. We might even sell the otter. We'll put the dirty rat in front, and we'll put the elephant up front as well. These guys are both very good for the damage strategy, uh, like with the peacock and that kind of stuff, because the rat, the 1-1 one, one dirty rat is, well, it's usually just a 1-1, one, one, so it'll trigger your on damage things the same way that the elephant will. Give it a reroll. Uh, I don't really see anything here I want. On sell, give two friends plus one health. Well, I guess we'll take the beaver over the otter. Roll again. Another rat. Uh, well, we don't quite need these fish. So we'll go ahead and sell a fish. What are these smuggles doing again? Before faint, give plus two to the nearest friend. We'll sell it. Well, give all friends plus one plus one. We'll sell it. We'll sell the fish. We'll sell the fish, and we'll get a second rat. We'll put the elephant in the back since we don't have anything to trigger. It's damage synergies. It's gonna just uh, be doing damage to us. So we'll run it. See how it goes. We can sell these. We should have sold the beaver. What a fool we were. Okay, well that fish is terrifying, to be honest. Uh, yep. Looks like we're gonna make it through all right, though. There's a 1-1. One, one. There we go. Okay, first win. So we're 1-1-1. We're one, one, one. It's not a bad ratio. We'll run it back. There's our rat. We didn't even need to freeze it. So we'll level up. Get a level 2 rat. A turt. I, I actually haven't played with the turtle before. I'm not a big fan of it, though, to be honest. Um, we're gonna roll again. We got the horsey. Uh, none of these things are things that I like. We'll roll again. We got yet another rat, and we got the peacock. The peacock is exactly what we're looking for. Uh, so we will take the peacock. Uh, sell, give two friends plus one health. So we will sell you. Uh, we'll sell the fish first. I don't think we want the fish in our deck anymore. So we'll sell the fish, and we'll sell the beaver. These guys are probably gonna stick with us for the rest of the entire game. We'll go ahead and get another rat. Put this here. 
I need to think for a second. Is uh, so there's gonna be two dirty rats. We'll put the elephant here, and we'll. I think two rats is better than one. We'll go ahead and pass the turn. Access gold. Oh, let's reroll. We can reroll. Uh, none of these things are things that I want. Go ahead and run it back. Uh, so hopefully this peacock doesn't die. I'd really like to find the garlic now. Is garlic something that I like to see? Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, perfect. The mosquito hit our peacock. Exactly what we wanted. Uh, it looks like we're not going to be doing so high. I think this elephant's going to take out our peacock. Uh-oh. Okay, it's a draw. A draw is better than a loss, and it looks like my camera has stopped working. I'm going to go ahead and turn that off. We've got level 3 pets, so now the, the game is in hardcore mode. Every time we lose, we lose 3 lives, so we got 3 losses left. Webcam on. Okay, I don't want any of these. Uh, none of these things are really what suits my fancy, so we'll roll again. Another uh, peacock. I do like a second peacock. We'll put this next to the peacock. See what else we got. Reroll. I don't want any of these. Uh, ooh, yes. The camel. The camel is like the peacock. Uh, I think the camel is a little bit better than the peacock. I guess that makes sense. It's a level 3 friend compared to level 2 friend. Roll again. Wow, wow, wow. So many peacocks. That's excellent for us, though. And a garlic. We'll freeze the garlic, too. So our next turn looks like it's all pretty much set up for us. Uh, the question is, do we freeze both the peacocks? Uh, that's a good question. We'll just leave it as it is. We'll go ahead and run it. I still think two rats are better than the one. Uh, just because a 4-5 is better than a 7-10. So we'll run it. See how it goes. Ooh. Maybe I was wrong about a 4-5 being better than a 7-10. But it's okay because those rats got eliminated. Okay. I'm not too sure if we're going to make it out of this one alive. Let's see how it goes. Uh, well, just barely we make it. Just barely. Webcam is down again, so you know what? That just means we're going to have to play with the webcam off today. Run it back. We got the peacocks. We got two garlics. Oh, dear goodness. Uh, we're going to just go ahead and garlic our way up. Garlic on the guy. Garlic on the other one. We'll go ahead and upgrade a peacock. We got a worm. Shot food eaten. No, thank you. Reroll. Wow, another peacock. Another camel. Do we want the third garlic? I'm feeling in the mood for the third garlic. We'll freeze it. We will go ahead and run it back. At this point... We'll consolidate our rats. Okay, go ahead. Let's see how it goes. The Bumbling Bones against the Shine Tanks. Oh my goodness, they also have the Elephant Turtle Synergy. Elephant, uh... Okay, so as long as this, uh... This, uh... Uh-oh. We are enabling their deck. We're enabling them. Uh-oh. I think we're gonna lose this one. 10-14. It's gonna beat their 9-7. Okay. Okay. And thankfully we are able to survive their 2-2... Grasshopper, just barely. Oh my goodness, that was close. Okay, we got better pets unlocked. At the end of turn, give level 2 and level 3 friends plus... Yes, please, thank you very much. We'll take you. Uh, we'll give our camel a little bit of a buff. We'll give our peacock a little bit of a buff. And we'll roll again. Another camel? No, no camel, but that's alright. Uh, do we still want this garlic? We'll leave the garlic. And we'll run it back. Not too sure where to put this penguin. We can throw it in the front, sacrifice it, but that might enable someone's damage strategies. So we'll just have it in the back. Uh-oh. We've got the deer. The deer is one of the most terrifying enemies. Okay, let's see how well we can do. This rat's a three once. It's going to take out our elephant. Really putting a hamper on our synergy build. Yes, sir. It looks like we're going to lose this one. There is very little chance of us coming back with that penguin. Okay. Well, that's our second loss of the day. It's no big deal. 
And, oh my goodness, we have a level 3 peacock. They just wanted to give us a peacock. A monkey, give the rightmost creature really big. Uh, well, I like really big creatures. And this happens every turn. Uh, so let's see, you get three friends plus one. So you got two friends here plus one. You know, we'll give the monkey a freeze. We'll give it a roll. If we can get a camel, that'd be nice. I do not see a camel, but there is another rat. I think that the monkey might be better than the penguin, to be honest. So we'll go ahead and get the monkey. Sell the pingu. Sorry, pingu. Get a monkey. We will freeze this rat. So now we might have a chance of getting a third one. We'll say, go ahead. Excess gold, we'll reroll. Nothing that we see here good. Level three friend game plus two plus two. Oh, actually that bison's uh the bison's pretty good, so we have a peacock. Mm. The bison have to take the place of the monkey. We'll we'll leave it. We'll leave it as it is. You know, maybe we'll find a better level four, level five friend next turn. Our 1014 is not going to be outmatched, thank goodness. There is an 8 4 in the back lines, and they do have a horse, level 2 horse, so our, our build is going to do some anti synergy. Yes, sir. Well, at least they got rid of the rats that we gave them. Uh, this camel is not going to do enough damage to take out that grasshopper, but fortunately, our peacock is massive. Oh my goodness, is it huge! I have never seen a peacock so large in my life before. And it's going to hit a sweep, sweep, sweep. 50 damage looks like it's the maximum that we can do. I didn't even know that. Okay, now we're at level 5. Ooh, canned food. I love canned food. Makes everything bigger. Uh, we will buy our rat. One more rat's all we need to get a maximum level rat. Looks like we're running into a lot of horse builds today. Ooh, another elephant. And the shark. Whenever a friend faints, they get bigger. Uh, we'll just go ahead and take the elephant. Uh, we'll actually freeze the elephant and put some garlic. I want to put it on the elephant since it has the most synergy, so we will. We'll say go ahead. Our rat is a unit. <laughs> 1318. Unfortunately, the way that our build is, we need our elephant behind the rat. Oh dear goodness, that was a very big fish. That is a huge fish. That fish is an absolute monster of an animal. It has swept our team. That fish knew how to eat. But that's alright. We'll run it again. We are at our last life, essentially. Oh, we can upgrade our camel. The chili. The chili is very good. What do you do? Can the coconut on hurt? Only once though. Uh, so we do want this chili, and since our rat is such a unit, we're going to give it to the rat. We have something to freeze, so we can go ahead and give it one more roll. We've only got that. Let's see, the whale. We're not playing a whale build. So we might as well... Oh, another chili. Um, chili on the elephant is an anti-synergy. So we'll go ahead and buff our elephant. Uh, we could put chili on the monkey, but that's all right. We'll go ahead and run it for the next turn. Every round can be our last. You never know. We're at three health, and everything takes three damage. Let's see how we can do. With our 1521 stack up, it looks like our 1521 will stack up pretty well against this build. Wowie wow. Two melons. Okay, at least our elephant's going to be able to take out this bison. Never mind, it's got the melon. Oh no. Oh, no, no, no. Our build had anti-synergy with their build, so that was the end of that run. I'm going to go ahead, go ahead, reconfigure my webcam. Try and see if we can get things running back up again. And I'll see you back for one more route. We're back, and this time we're going to be playing the weekly expansion pack. Uh, so we don't want any of these. We want to find some of our new friends. Shop food bot makes them bigger. Give one plus two. Well, we'll see. We're going to be pretty much stuck with these guys since, uh, well, they're what we got in our starting run. So I'll go ahead and take these ladybugs and an otter. I like to buy as many pets as I can in the beginning wave because you can sell them. And that's just more gold in the future. We are the slippery hands. 
Let's find our first opponent. Let's see how the Slippery Hands fare up against the Gnarly Whippersnappers. That is going to be a massive Iguana. It's going to sweep our team. We have been swept. That's okay. Losing turn one is not the worst thing that happens. Especially if you got a nice build to sell. Well, we can have a level two, a level two Ladybug. Not too sure how I feel about that, to be honest. Shop food gain plus one, plus one till the end of turn. It's not really the best. But we'll put it here. See how things go. Roll again. Yet another ladybug. A chinchilla. I like the chinchilla, to be honest. The chinchilla is like the pig. Gives you an extra gold when it's sold, because you, uh... When you get the... Uh, you get an extra chinchilla. So we'll put you here. We'll put you here. Oh, and we got a rat. You know, I, I, I'm such a fan of the rat. I can't say no. So here's our team. I think we're done with our ladybug, though, to be honest. So we're not going to freeze the next one. We'll go ahead and run it back, see what our friends are doing. We got a moth. Two moths. Those moths are going to be huge. So you're going to take out our rat. Uh, but our ladybug is still a unit. It looks like our unit is going to be sweeping their whole team. I have never seen a ladybug do so much damage before. Okay. Tier 2 pets unlocked. We got one a little bit early since we upgraded our team. Uh, this copy is a faint ability. I don't expect any faint abilities to be happening in the early the early tiers that I quite like. So we'll go ahead and we'll go ahead and reroll all these. With a hurt ability, do we have any hurt abilities? I don't think we have any hurt abilities, although we do have a nice hurt build going. But you are on purchase. We're gonna go ahead and probably sell a chinchilla. Friend sold, give a friend plus one health. Well, you know what? We're gonna be going ahead and selling a chinchilla. We'll, we'll reroll, see what we get first. Another chinchilla. I, I don't want it really. This, well, that's all I gotta say is I don't want it. Another otter. I still don't want it. Uh, we'll roll again. Ah, a peacock. Well, now we got the hurt. And it even buffed the ones we wanted it to buff. We'll go ahead and freeze this peacock since we have an extra coin. Roll again, see if we get anything nice. Didn't really see anything we want. Put this peacock here. We can sell the otter. It exists, but we don't need the money right now, so we'll save it for our next next wave. We'll go ahead and run it. We got a big rat. We got a big ladybug. We'll see how we fare. Oh my goodness, that is a huge peacock. How did it get so big? Just tell me how. That's going to sweep our whole team. How did they get such a big peacock so early? 11 health? I mean, we could just start buying it. I mean, geez, geez, holy wows. Oh, okay, I like the croissant. Give something plus one, plus one every turn. It's good to have those early. We'll go ahead and freeze that one of those. Give it a roll. See what we got. We got another ladybug. And yet another shrimp. I'm not a big fan of these tier two pets. They don't really have any synergy with the uh, mid to late game. Peach gives one friend plus two health. Well, I, I'm such a big fan of the peacock rat synergy, but I don't think we can keep, always just keep running it. We'll roll again on the moth, give the friend some, some battle. Each shot food gets plumb with an attack down turn. Yeah, I don't I don't really like any of these, but we'll go ahead and buy the otter, I guess. Give us some health. Roll again. Ooh, the frigate bird. Frigate bird is one that we like. We'll go ahead and sell the otter. We'll buy the frigate bird. Um, we're gonna sell our shrimp here probably. We can sell the bird as well. Because I want to buy this croissant. Croissant on the rat. It's gonna make us a huge rat. Uh, selling the bird has more synergy since we have this. And I picked the one that I like too. Wow. Our luck never ends uh, whenever someone buys shot food. Okay. Well, that's great. Uh, we'll keep the shrimp in our back lines. We'll run it back. Our team's pretty beefy now, but let's see if we're beefy enough. Oh my goodness, that is a beefy moth. That is a very beefy moth. That moth is going to sweep our whole team again. It looks like since their back line is pretty weak, this uh, ladybug's going to take care of it. So that was fortunate for us. They had a weak back line. We had a nice spread out team. Tier 3 pets. The game becomes real now. Uh, so we'll go ahead and get a, get a peacock. Peacock. 
411. We can buy another frigate bird, but I'm going to actually just freeze the frigate bird. Gives the nearest friend plus one plus one each turn. Plus one plus one each turn. It's pretty solid. I'm going to be say so myself. Uh, but we will roll again. Another rat. I like the rats. Uh, we can buy the frigate bird. Plus two health of the peacock. That's a peach. This is a peach. Okay. You know, I'm okay with the peach, because with the peach, at least we have a frigate bird. Uh, we will put the bird behind the ladybug. And we'll put this behind this. And go ahead and run it. Let's see how things go. Seven, seven rats. Not bad. My webcam is not cooperating today. My apologies. Well, it looks like we got a pretty nice clean sweep. This, uh, oh my goodness, this bus is going to win. Wow, I did not see that ending coming. Who could have seen that happen? Well, now we are playing almost hardcore mode. We have at least one extra life. This lollipop attacks, switches to the attack and health. We can have a very tanky... Uh, no, I'm not too into that. I'm not too into any of that. I'm not too into any of these guys down here either. Roll again, yet another ladybug. Friend ahead attacks, get plus two, plus two. I am into that, so we'll go ahead and sell you. We'll go ahead and get a kangaroo. Yeah, you're really good at giving health to my, uh, the one that I want you to give health to. Roll again, seagulls, friend summon, copy this, held food. Uh, I don't think that's going to be too useful for us. Give it yet another roll. A pug can upgrade either of these two. Uh, although I don't think it's better than... Or ladybug at this point. Yet another ladybug. They really want us to take the ladybugs. They're like, come on, dude. I'm giving it to you for free. You should take it. We will go ahead and end the turn. I'm not too confident in our ability to succeed in this one. But we'll see how it goes. Okay, you know what? I am confident in our ability to succeed with this one. I'm not too sure what their build's trying to do. Enjoy the rat. Oh, it's good with the meat bone, I guess. I wonder how multiple, uh, multiple seagull stack. Okay, fortunately for us, we still have two lives, two lives, so we have two losses left. I'm confident to not lose twice. Sheep, ox. Uh, let's see, none of these things are really synergistic with us. Although we can put the ox and then the sheep. Not really what I'm looking for right now, though. Go ahead, give another reroll. We got the giraffe again, we got the rooster. When it dies, make all pets take plus three damage. That's pretty crazy. I'm gonna give it another roll. Another guy, so we're gonna upgrade our team. Up ooh, the shark, whenever one of our friends dies. Ooh, and the scorpion. You know, I've never taken a scorpion yet. Uh, the cucumber actually is insane. I'm gonna freeze the scorpion. Uh, we're gonna sell, we'll sell you. And we'll give a cucumber to our peacock. Uh, okay, that looks like a team. I don't think we're, we're not playing a summon build, so we're going to go ahead and end the turn. Run it again. See how our croissant cucumber combo stacks up against our opponents. Uh, they got the deer. The deer is terrifying, actually, in my opinion. Oh, well, they, they, they brought out our ladybug. I don't really want our ladybug out here, but that's all right. It's uh, anti-synergistic with our... Well, it looks like we're going to have a draw. No shame in a draw. I'd appreciate a draw over a loss any day. I don't know what the peanut does, so I'm going to go ahead and buy the scorpion. Gain the peanut. Knock out any a pet attacked by and hurt by this. So I guess you're good with the melon if we have a turkey. Uh, let's see, Do we can we find a turkey? Hurt and faint, give friends plus one health. Hurt, deal six damage back to the pet that hurt this. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, I think the armadillo is probably better than the ladybug. I'm not sure where we'd want it though. I think the porcupine is also better than the ladybug, so we'll go ahead and sell this. Get a porcupine. Roll again. Right now I think we want a turdy. A little turts. 
Oh, we can go ahead. Oh, you have a peanut though, so we can't we can't give you an HP buff. Hmm. A cucumber on the porcupine. One more roll. Yep, nothing that I see. We'll go ahead and end our turn. Do we want to freeze the cucumber? No, not not in particular. Although I would like always like the cucumber. Cucumber is a uh, there's no garlic in the weekly, so it's the best we got. Ooh, goodness. They've got the weaken everything. Weaken is not good for our build. Especially when they have the melon. So many things with the melon. Oh, rough. Very rough for us. We're down to our last HP. That means that any battle can be our last. Swampy attack and health of all pets. And another kangaroo. And this scorpion should not be in the back, since if it dies, you don't get the peanut ability. So I'll put you in the front. Uh, you also should not be in the back, so I guess we'll have some heavy damage in the front to get some maximum utility out of our rats. Uh, we'll freeze this roll again. What do you do? Before attack, make the enemy target weak works once per turn. Hmm. You're a 4-6. Hurt, deal 2 damage to a random enemy. Mm, what's the carrot do? Give one pet the carrot. Plus one, plus one at the end of turn. Oh my goodness. The carrot is insane. Uh, so we'll go ahead and use the carrot. We'll give it to the kangaroo. Since all our other guys have some food, we'll go ahead and give the kangaroo another kangaroo since we're committed to it. And one of the turn. Everybody eat your food. Thank you. So let's see how our scorpion boy does. Little peanut. Oh, it's going to take out an 11-11. That's nice. Uh, okay. Kangaroo is not quite where I want it to be. This seems fine. This is fine. This is fine. Great, we were successful. Well, wow. honestly expected a draw. That's how I'm expecting most games to go from now on. It's end in a draw. Uh, none of these things are things that I want. Our build is pretty, pretty solidified. Canned food. I'll always take some canned food. Ooh, and the deer. I love the deer as well. Uh, the the chili on the truck. It's pretty good. Um, we'll freeze you. What do you do? A friend adds sell ability, give plus one plus one to a friend. Nothing I really see here that I like. Another carrot, some more canned food. Uh, deal eight damage to the last enemy. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Well, if we sell something, we can buy the alligator and the canned food. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead. Buy the canned food. We can sell our porcupine. Oh, it's a nice beefy boy. We'll put our team up one space. And we'll get an alligator. We will freeze this carrot, since the carrot we learned is kind of nuts. Unfreeze. Okay, well, we got nothing left. Everything to lose. Let's run it. Let's see how good we can do. 519. See, this is why I buy the cucumber really early. Look how big our, uh, look how big our peacock's gotten. Well, this peanut's not going to do too much work. Oh, rip our alligator. Oh my goodness, they are doing so much damage. Is this game just going to end before it starts? Well, it's a draw. Draw is not a loss, so I'll take it. We got another round. We got to see what we find. Okay, what do we have? We got another rat. Doesn't make our rat level 2. End turn, give plus 1, plus 1. Multiply with turn number. Oh, until end of battle. It's turn 11. So let's give someone plus 11, 11. Dear goodness, plus 11, 11. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> uh, so we'll go ahead and get a rat. A leopard. Start of the battle with 50 damage to one random enemy. So that's 7. You're 8. I think you're going to get the ability to trigger more times. But this is random. This is the last. What I think we're going to actually happen to do is uh, sell our crocodile. Sell our crocodile here get our stegosaurus, 
put our stegosaurus, sell the peanut maybe. Yeah, we'll sell the peanut. Put our stegosaurus out. Uh, we can stegosaurus our kangaroo, I think. Yeah, the kangaroo seems like a reasonable one. Actually, we can make an insane... Yeah, we can make an insane sized uh, scorpion. <laughs> uh, yeah. Not got any pet attacked and hurt by this. It'd be an 11 11 scorpion. Uh. Yeah, we'll sell the croc. We'll sell the croc. We'll see if we can get this scorpion to go off. Let's take a uh, We got the carrot frozen down. Uh, do we want to freeze a cheetah? No, we'll roll again. Oh, you can have a stegosaurus. Wow. Two random pets plus four HP. We'll just go ahead and get the next stegosaurus. Uh, no, we won't use excess gold. We'll go ahead and see if we can get something. We'll go ahead and freeze this kangaroo. Snake, friend ahead attack, still five damage to one random enemy. Snake seems pretty good too. Uh, we'll freeze it, see what we get. Go ahead. Yeah, 12 12 scorpion. That's a unit. That's an absolute unit. And they're, they're going to just have something with 13 power to show up and just ruin our day. There it is. I don't even know if the peanut's going to trigger. Okay, it did. Uh, let's see. We might be able to take this one. Yeah, it looks like we're going to take it. That was very fortunate. Okay. Victory for us. Now let's see what we got. Well, we're going to want to go ahead and upgrade this kangaroo. Uh, I'm not sure we're going to have this snake. We'll leave it there because it's one of the better things we got. We'll roll again. Uh, canned food. Always love some canned food, to be honest. Canned food and his investment in our future. Same with this carrot. Uh, so now we'll go ahead and get a bigger scorpion. See how things go. Okay, it looks like we're gonna lose this one, in my opinion. Yeah, that that's a that's a very big seagull back there. Although it looks like we do survive the seagull. Nope, we don't. Uh, my math was wrong. Well, that's our loss. We lost to their polar bear. And, you know, I'm going to have to call it here for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you like the content, please give it a like and a subscription as well. Um, again, always leave a comment if you're feeling extra bold. But that's going to be it for me today, so I hope you have a nice day. And bye-bye. Uh,